The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 9 a.m. update, and uh, currently got a mixed bag out here. you got the Dow Futures up 25. The NASDAQ are off 45. You've got the ES uh, off 2. The Russell is up uh, 30 cents out there. Over in Asia last night, a mixed bag. The uh, Shanghai was off 12 points, and the EK up 96. The Hang Seng up 109. Both the DAX and the FTSE are trading higher. They're up by 110 and 33 points, respectively. Gold having a big move this morning. It's up 1.5%, uh, 26 bucks, trading out at 1808. Silver up 1 and 7 tenths percent. That's 42 cents. That's trading at 24.59. Light to be crude up 73 pennies. Natural gas up 18 cents. So, what's all that mean? Well, to find out, we go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. We begin by taking a look at the ES mini. We can see an A to B equals CD pattern to the upside. Unless a bearish reversal candle forms, price should go target its next C to D price projection level. And that's at 45.78. The spot volatility says that the wind is at the back of the S&P 500 because price is below that 50-day exponential moving average, which is priced at 18.55. The spot fix is trading at 15.14. We take a look at the NQ out here. It, too, is an A to B equals CD pattern. However, it has formed a new resistance level. That resistance level, and it also a support area, but the resistance level is going to be 15 483. If price closes above that, you're going to see a move to 15602. If price doesn't close above that, well, it could seek support, and that's between 15214 and 15304. The U.S. dollar index has generated a topping pattern. Price is back inside its daily profile, maybe signaling a move all the way back to 9312. Gold, if gold can close above 190160, uh, I'm sorry, 180160, don't get ahead of yourself, Stevie. 1801.90. Let me give you the exact price. That's the high from October 14th. We'll get a new A to B equals CD pattern to the upside, and price will go target 1838. Light sweet crude is having a nice breakout. In fact, it looks like it. I'm not light sweet crude. Silver looks like it'll close above the top of its weekly profile. That's at 2423. That generates a change in trend signal. Light sweet crude generated a sell the D point yesterday, but price is above its oscillator and change line. Not shown here, but you can see a brand new profile is formed, and so its resistance level is going to be at the 834. Level natural gas should be on its way up to the 573 area, and the 30 year treasury is holding support that support level 157.14. Folks, stay tuned. Tommy O'Brien is up next. Great programming during the day. I'll see you on Monday. Have a fantastic weekend. Take care, folks.